Yo, I want to know why they get so angry when you come on the show. I don't know. Probably because they don't want to hear about twerk. <laughs> but they do want to hear about twerk. They do. That's, that's your job. Free twerk, man. That's your job. Facts. Doing your job very Facts, well. Man. Thank you. Thank you. I mean, but what you do that? What are you drinking? You drinking slime juice? What the fuck is that? It's some shit, Rita. Yeah, it's a, yeah, put my shit there. a ice matcha tea. Oh, okay. okay yeah, you. it was all right. Yo, so how, how you feeling about Gnome? How you feel about this car? We know what you will always get the real answers. How you feeling about this? Uh, I think it's decent, man. Like, I don't, I don't, I'm with you 100%. Like, <clears throat> is Danny Myers versus none, none? Because, I mean, that's the battle. Mm-hmm. Is that something that like, when you think about Gnome immediately you think of? Absolutely not. But it was just, you know, three weeks ago, four weeks ago, none none versus she. Oh, man, none none versus uh, Sharon. Yo, get this man a bigger plate. Let him get on Gnome. Now he's on Gnome and people don't want to see it. No, but but that's why I be saying you can't listen to certain people in this culture because niggas just talk to talk. You, you got to remember Gnome 11 Going into Gnome 11, a bunch of people were saying, oh, we tired of the same faces. Stop doing the same rotation. They announced, right, a right. Car. they announced a car, not just with new names, but a bunch of new niggas that's killing, and then we get told this is not known. Right, right. And then they watch it, and then, you know what I mean, the battles that happened was one of the better gnomes. Right, right. You get some fire battles. I'm, yeah, I'm not going to lie. Yeah. For me... The only thing that quote unquote wasn't known about it was, you know, of course it was in that in that that small room. But other than that, the matchups, I, I mean, it is what it is, bro. When you think about it, you look at some of the old flyers. I seen somebody post like uh the gnome eight or gnome flyer, uh, gnome eight or gnome nine flyer next to this one. And they're like, Oh, this is a gnome. But if you look at that flyer, everybody on there has battled everybody on there. Mm-hmm. So unless you want to get to a point where gnome is two battles or rematches, or but not even that. What I'm sa- what I'm saying is we in a new time and a new era. It's like if you think wrestling, right? How many years is Undertaker, <clears throat> Shawn Michaels, Triple H, Stone Cold, The Rock? Gonna, right. I mean, it, it has to. You you you. At some point in time, you know, with a marquee event, you always need those two battles that set the tone. Which on this is Goods and Easy, T Top and Tay Rock. Aside right. from that, we don't build new stars and we continue just to have the same rotation over and over and over. And you gotta you gotta I feel like a gnome slot or some of madness slot, it shouldn't be guaranteed based on stature. It's guaranteed right. based on the work that you're putting in. So when right. we go what down you doing we, right now. Yeah, when we go down that lane, none none deserves to be on gnome. Hundred percent. Danny Myers deserves to be on gnome. J C deserves to be on gnome. Swamp deserves to be on gnome so like that's that's what i'm basing it on like i feel like every year gnome it, that's that's what makes it i feel like i feel like if 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 there's enough money put in battle rap but now we need certain people to do the dirty work if there was statistics or stats or shit right even a fan vote like the all-star game certain shit should be voted in like it should be like a certain, let's say we're doing six battles on Gnome. It should be six people, or not matter of fact, eight people that's voted in by the fans to be on Gnome every single year. And then the, and then the last four individuals, that's who, I mean, the staff picks. And then, See, and then the matchups get made. The, the one problem with that, though, is, well, when you say should be voted in, you mean by the fans? Yeah, like we're not talking matchups. This this person is just right. Just people should have a spot. Yeah, this person pro- should. I, I think the problem with that though is man, the fans are so finicky, man. Like you said, like you, you a month ago, everybody was here for none none being. But on watch all. this though. Did you hear the trick? They don't like none none versus Danny. They don't get to choose that. Oh, okay. They, they just saying. get to choose. Boom. None none should be on no. I mean, okay, and, I got you. And then also, and then also, they don't get to choose the names. So somebody could be a fan of such and such. Of course, they're going to vote for him and put them. No, URL gets the list of the individuals that have been killing in the year, and then they okay. vote on that. Yeah, they don't so have the, no. So, so you'll have your, your list of eligible people. Yeah. So now, when they, now a month ago, they would have already voted for none none. So it'd be like, look. Y'all niggas, y'all niggas is talking crazy. Y'all already voted for him to be on it, so we put right. him on. Him. I mean, right, yeah, but right. y'all, y'all don't, y'all not, y'all don't get to make the matchups 
and y'all don't get to decide, decide who's eligible. Y'all just have a choice because then it's like the All Star game. Like you can you can get mad all you want. LeBron puts up them numbers every year. He's in the right. All Star game. Steph Curry, Kevin Durant, James Harden, they in there. And then obviously, you know what I mean. Then the captains pick the teams. Right. You know what I mean, and then okay. the coaches and the staff I mean, they pick they pick the reserves. I mean, I, I think that would be dope. Yeah, and I and, and, and it don't dope. necessarily got to be for no. Or some of madness. This could be for double impact. Whatever. It could be all star, however they want it. But I just think that adds, not I mean, more more shit into the not I mean, I guess into yeah. the into Yeah, another little element, man. Yeah. That'll be dope. That'll be dope. I am here for it. Um, what what's the status on Twerk? When is is he is he coming home soon? What are we doing? Uh yeah, Lord Lord willing, man. Lord willing, he'll be home in time for uh uh for gnome. Like that that's really what you know what I mean, we're shooting for. Hopefully, um, Legally, things is looking good, so Fine. you know it's it's really it just gotta as long as he don't get in no trouble, man. Like that's the main thing, you know. Unfortunately, in jail, it's hard to let shit walk, like let shit, uh, let shit go because it's jail. Like yeah, you know multiple I mean? reasons you can't let it go. And if you if some shit right. go down and you let it slide, that's gonna make another thing, another nigga right. think that they right. can play exactly. with you. So you gotta make examples. That's the tricky part about it. Even if you in there. For a short period of time, because you see certain people be like, "Yo, man, why are you saying free twerk? It's only in there for sixty days." Like, nigga, do you know what ha- what can happen being in jail exactly. for, for a day? Exactly, bro. Listen, I mean? he, he got sent to the hole for a week. A CO said that he told him he was going that he threatened him and said he was going to kill him, bro. If, if he would have went to court that Monday and they found him guilty, that was an extra six months right there. Like that sixty days don't Crazy. mean shit. It's actually a hundred day sentence. Um, but the, it's like, because it's a misdemeanor, uh, you get like, you only got to do 60% of it, some shit like, you know, uh, each Commonwealth state is a little different, but yeah, yeah, man. So every day, like <clears throat> I'd be talking to him and just trying to keep his spirits up, telling him about the crazy shit going on in battle rap and, you know, laughing about this and that, this and that, trying to set up different matches, um, for when he get home, you know, I, I know nobody wants to see twerk of course, cause all he does is choke, but at the same time, you know. He, he Listen, had, man, uh, just, just just like the same way you said, I mean, they wanted to see none none a month ago. It's reversed. They say all of right. that, and you know, what I mean, twerk could get up there, and everybody will have their phone out or their computer set with their eyes glued to the screen. That's just right. the world. Listen, he had he had uh uh like this is the funny part, man. Again, it's it's I hate the word narrative, but it really is the thing. Yo, yeah, they get mad, but you got to use it like that. Yeah, yo, he is. has two battles this year, right? Twerk mm-hmm. has four rounds of material. He fucked up versus real name Brandon in a one rounder. Then he got up there and, and got crazy with Snake Eyes for three rounds of Midnight Madness. Now, what they do is then they say, that's cool, but he fucked up versus Surf too. All right, that was last year. I'll give you that. But it's like, you know, he was supposed to be in a tournament. That shit was going to get crazy. Unfortunately, this shit happened. But, you know, um, I, I've been talking to some people. I, I've been on Twitter and, and just you know, looking to see what the temperature is like. And, and I'm going to be honest, man, like, I don't like some of the stuff that people are saying on Twitter, some of the battle rappers. So, real name Brandon, he's going to he gonna have to get smoked, man. Mm. I made a phone call, but I think he's in protective custody. But um, <laughs> I, I'm serious, man. I don't know what's up with him. You know, shout out to, oh, the West runs battle rap. Okay, I get what you mean when you say they run battle rap. But, you know, we're going to leave that double mm. button sitting right there. And what um, got bars? Say hello to my Listen, man. Friend. Shout out, <laughs> shout out to little redhead nigga. What's his name? Next, shout out to him. Yeah, he was talking crazy. Uh, mm-hmm. yep. Phone calls was made. Nigga was like, no. You know what I mean, uh, and then A War came out of nowhere. Yeah, just jumping in the yeah, conversation. I seen, I seen him. Yeah, bro, had nothing to do with not a. Ain't nobody said nothing close to A War, Horseman, or white people. Here he come. So, <laughs> um, you know, he he been talking shit for a minute. <laughs> And I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie, know. Rita. See about that cough over there. That shit sound dangerous. Oh, she, she nah, Anwar is crazy. <laughs> talking about white people. Ain't nobody say nothing about. Ain't white nobody people. say nothing about no white people. We was. Awar just came right out of there, appropriating the conversation. Shout out to <laughs> But um, so yeah, man. Like I, I told Turk about what was going on, and I mean, he said, "Fuck it." Like yo, like he tired of Awar talking, and so am I. Awar was there when Turk battled Loso. Yeah. He packed Loso up, sent Loso to the big to the uh, big Bible study in the sky. Awar is sitting right there. Awar actually helped one of the haymakers land. Yeah, 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 yeah. That was nasty work. Yeah, right. Exactly. And the funny thing is this, man. Like, 
I was arguing with somebody. I'm not going to say their name just because I don't know how, how in the public they want to be about it. But I was arguing with, with somebody yesterday about Twerk versus A-Ward. I'm like, bro, like, I know why A-Ward wants to battle Twerk. I do. A-Ward is, is phenomenal. Let me make that clear. Like, yeah. A-Ward is definitely one of them niggas. Um, but, bro, I don't battle rap. And I, I can tell you everything A-Ward is going to rap about right now. He's going to go up there. You choke. You only battle on URL or you only care about URL. You had Rome DMV as a manager. You got Anwar as a manager. Uh, uh, and you be playing with your talents. That's a words. That's, that's all his material right there in four sentences. Now, is he going to be creative about it? Absolutely. But, bro, when it's that predictable, if I can see all that you're going to rap about, bro, what you think Twerk going to do with a word, man? Mm. And look at his track record versus um, Christian Battle. It's like, bro, come on, man. So I, I'm, I'm here for that one midnight madness. Um, you know, mm-hmm. I don't know what a word situation is with URL, so I'm not even going to make that phone call. Yeah, he yeah, said yeah. Midnight Madness. Uh, they both team ball game. Hopefully Hitman put some bread up. But I, I have text sir. He ain't text me back. But I I, I want to, I want to, I, I really want to send a like, I want to quiet him down a little bit. He real vocal beating up everybody at Backyard Battle League or cooking <laughs> URL guys in one rounders and driveways. Okay, cool. Like, I really, I like, I, I, I need him to, to understand what's up over here. So that's the two people like, Right now, I'm really focused on A Ward and real name Brandon. And, and real name Brandon. All right, got you. Um, before you get out of here, um, let me get your known predictions. T Top and Tay Rock, what we doing? I can't call that one, man. I really can't. T Top, bro, that that video battle, bro. Like nobody told T Top that shit was an exhibition. T Top, <laughs> yeah, T Top made T Top rap against Tay Rock like that shit was summer madness. Yeah. Um, but it's like T-Top is one of the greatest anglers, um, you know, of our time. And I know that he can, you know, go farther with that angle and his other shit to talk about. But now, like, it's, it's almost like he told Tay-Rock, like, yo, I'm really going to try to kill you. And Tay-Rock, one of them dudes, bro, you can't. If Rock know that ahead of time, bro, like, and he been chilling, like, you know, um, he did the Vixen battle. He, he, he got crazy with her, but that was two weeks notice. Mm-hmm. Other than that, he only had the Danny Myers battle. Everybody was saying Danny cleared him, bro. Rock is still Rock, so that nigga got a chip on his shoulder. Man, I can't call that one. Um, I really can't. Goods and easy. Oh man, I'm going easy two one. Shout out to Goods. Mm-hmm. Goods can, is can, fire. Can we can we make a little wager on that? I'm available. Absolutely, absolutely, we can, man. You're not gonna wheeze a lot of the bet though, right? Um, nah, nah, for okay. sure. Nah, I'm not. Okay. What, what we yeah, we'll, we'll talk. All right. Um, but yeah, no, man. Shout out to Goods, man. All right. Um, Hollow and Geechee. Uh, John John convinced me that Geechee's going to win this battle. Um, I wasn't sure at first because Hollow is, is one of my favorites. But yeah. when when he kept saying, like, bro, I, I can't think of a, a, of a good Hollow, uh, excuse me, um, like a win when it was something personal. Like, like he said, bro, and it's like when you look back at that track record, John John was the first one, like, you know what I mean, you think back, and John John got that one. Then the math battle, we all know how that went. Then uh, um, uh, he battled you, yeah. you know how that went. Like, bro, I, I don't know. And even him and Shine, uh, you know, I had Shine edging it, but I, I get it, the masses had hollow, so I'm not here to argue that. 